This demo will simulate how you can achieve workflow through Myco's MyForms client and MyForms server software. The example will show a simple three-stage process where a work order is issued by a dispatcher, which is then accomplished by an inspector, and finally reviewed by a supervisor, where all parties are interfacing with their back-end systems. Here, you will see what happens on the form fillers end using the MyForms client, as well as what's happening in the back-end on the MyForms server side. Thus, we will be shifting views back and forth from server to form filler. Now let's start with taking a look at the MyForm server. As you can see, there are currently no active sessions, so everything's um, zero state. Now let's jump to Ferdy, who's our dispatch guy, and he accesses his MyForms client on his desktop, and he's office-based. So now he opens his client and starts a session. And in this case, it's a work request form. So it puts in a date and fills some information and assigns to this, uh, an inspector. In this case, he assigns it to Bill and puts in a facility, puts in some notes, scope of work. And as I want to point out, here he, ha he only has access to this exact page or this specific page, but actually there are other pages associated with this form. So he finishes up and sends that to the server. And now let's jump back to the server side and see what's happening over there. As you can see, now there's a live session under the users group, which Bill, the inspector, is part of. So now let's jump to Bill, who's a field inspector located somewhere else outside of the office. And he opens his MyForms client either on his tablet PC or some laptop or some other device. Syncs to the server and sees that there is one live session signed to him. Opens that up. And now he's on that same page that Ferdy created for him. And he can write on it if he wants to. But more importantly... After this, he'll go on to the next page, which is the page that he needs to fill up. So now we're in the facilities inspection page. And as you can see, a lot of information was already pre-filled for Bill. He checks on those except for the phone where he updates it because there was a change in phone apparently for that site or location. And he continues on filling up the form looking at all the fields, does, does a sketch, and eventually puts in an image. Take note that he can actually fill this form offline. It doesn't need to be connected or have internet connection or anything like that. What's important was when he synced to the server, you know, he only needs to sync once, and all that information is cached locally on his device. So when he goes out in the field and connection is, a, is an issue, that's no problem. And as you can see here, when he's done, he assigns it to Jane, who is its supervisor. He signs on it, his customer signs on it while in the site, and before finishing it, he actually looks at the approval page. And as you will see, even if he marks on it, it doesn't register, the ink doesn't register on it. That's because this page is specifically for supervisors only, or in this case, Jane. So he finishes that form, sends it to Jane, and now we're back on the server server updates and as you can see the users session is now zeroed out and the administrator session now has a live session which is Jane's group so let's jump to Jane now who is probably somewhere in another site could be on vacation could be in the Bahamas so she opens up her MyForms client on her laptop for example syncs to the server sees that live session and she can see what Ferdy the dispatcher did what Bill the inspector did and doesn't see any problems in this point in terms of any information or has any questions on it so she just approves it says yes on that and signs off on it 
and she finishes that session. So that session goes back to the server and that whole process is now done. In this case, there's actually an email that's automatically generated once she finishes a form and it's addressed directly to the customer in this case and an attached PDF copy of the inspection page is attached to it so that it can be sent to the customer for their file. And going back to the server, now there are no live sessions open and looking at it at the finished queue just to show you now it says there that you know it shows the date and all everything else and as you can see that was finished and in this case there was also an data exports created specifically for that session so there were PDFs in this case a CSV as well which records all that information make life easier with Myco's MyForms Data Capture Solutions.